Lovelies, it's Sarcasm the Sickness, and welcome back for day four of the 31 day challenge. I am seriously still so excited about this. I'm just, just the, the biggest reason I'm excited, of course, is just the immense amount of participation. Day two got literally over 30, yeah, literally over 30 submissions. I think it was like 33 or 34. It's insane. Um, day three so far has over 20, day one has over 20. I am just literally astounded. You guys are amazing and thank you so much for participating with me. Thank you for everyone who is doing videos, thank you everyone who is doing drawings, thank you everyone who's just in the comment section just telling me about your favorite Pokemon because honestly I really do want to know. I really am interested in hearing why and I already told you why last time. It's just I love hearing all the stories, I love hearing like, like, well, you know, I was losing this battle and then my Caterpie came through and I'm like, oh god, it's so beautiful! Or, you know, like, like I was trying to Masuda method and then the shiny Eevee popped out and it evolved into an Umbreon I'm like, oh, it's so great! You know, I really, I'm, I'm really loving hearing like all these different, all these different reason, reasonings and a lot of it, you know, some of it is just like, oh, I like this design or I like this whatever and that's fine because I do that too, a lot of the Pokemon on my list are based off of design more than anything else, including today's Pokemon. Today's theme is favorite electric type. Um, and my, f well actually I guess there is a little nostalgia tied into this one, but my favorite electric type is BAP Zapdos. Um, Zapdos is just really cool, I'm really excited about this. Um, I've never drawn a Zapdos before though, because it's kind of complicated, so this is going to be interesting. Oh, Frickle Frackle, I forgot to say the names of the people who are doing videos with me. Unknown Persona, The Great Bulbasaurus, Kuro Ryushin, Jimf, Apple Pie Queen, Master Lax, Liger Zero, Gliscor Jr. 98, Glix Alt, and the du wow, the Dueling Gentleman, which, by the way, the last one, du Dueling Gentleman, that's in French. I am trying to do my best to post the videos for the appropriate day on the, like, in the comment section so that you can just go into the comment section, look for something that says, hey lovelies, please check out so-and-so's day one video, day two video, day three, day four, whatever. Hopefully, uh, you'll actually find those in there. You really should be able to find them. But um, I'm trying to do that. I may not be able to get to all of them always, but I'm trying. Um, if I don't get to yours, you can post yours in the in the description. I'll thumbs it up so that people can see it. But yeah, anyway. Anyway. Um. <clears throat> yeah. So Zapdos is my fave, and I'm I might end up giving myself eight minutes on this because Zapdos is crazy complicated, or at least not crazy complicated, but it's it's I've never drawn it before. So anyway. I'm gonna start the countdown to so start the countdown. <laughs> Three, two, one. Bloop. Oh, it didn't do it. Bloop. There it goes. Okay, that was weird. Um. So yes, Zapdos is obviously. Uh, actually, Zapdos breaks the trend. Zapdos is the first non-Gen One Pokemon or Gen Five Pokemon on my list. So Zapdos should feel honored. Um, <laughs> Zapdos broke the trend. Zapdos is definitely my favorite of the three um, of the three legendary birds from Gen One. I like Zappy Bird; it's so great. Um, I loved. I guess. I guess my my biggest thing was um, Zapdos was the first. Um, I believe it was the first legendary that I ever found in game. I think because like I went, you know, you have to go back to the to the um, wow to the power plant and stuff and go find it and whatever or go do things in there, and Zapdos was the first legendary I ever found, so I do kind of have like a nostalgia factor with that. It is the very first legendary I caught, um, and like, you know, I like think the next one that you find is like Articuno, and then you find Moltres or whatever, but Zappy Bird holds a place in my heart. It's really just, it's really cool. It's really, really cool. Um, I love, I honestly really love electric types in general. Electric typing does have a lot of really cool Pokemon in it. So again, this 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 decision was kind of hard. Uh, there's like there's Luxray. Luxray is so cool. I love Ampharos. I love Mega Ampharos to be honest. Um, I love um, I love a lot of them. Like Plusle and Minin are so cute. And there's just there's just a re a lot of really good electric types or really really good design wise. Really good like 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 I love I love electric typing. I really do love electric typing. Um, 
So Zapdos is my fave electric type, and um, here we go. Um, yeah, it was just it was a really hard decision to make though. It was a really hard decision to make, but um, anyway, he's he's really cool, and I'm really trying to figure out exactly what I'm doing here with its with its freaking body, poor baby. What is going on here? I'm sorry, Zapdos. I am trying. I am I am trying. Um, it looks like a weird disembodied freaking. Like, or d beheaded, sorry, freaking Shedinger right now, but I'm trying! Uh, let's give it zappy wings and stuff. So yeah, this is my- f this is actually the first Pokemon on my list that I like specifically for- or almost very specifically for, like, nostalgia reasons. But, um... And I'm- again, I'm not afraid to admit that. I really do love Zapdos because it is that special legendary of mine. Um, I remember in Gold and Silver, I transferred it over from my, um, from, from my, uh, from my yellow version, I believe. Um, and, and yeah, it was like, it was, it was really powerful. It was really good for that, for the team there, like, you know, going to, I believe I brought it with me to fight Red. I believe, I believe it was probably the second Pokemon on my team to actually reach level 100. The first, of course, being the Pikachu from Pokemon Yellow. Um, cause you, you, you're with it, you're with it the whole time, of course it's gonna reach it first, you know? Um, but yeah, so Zapdos, Zapdos is one of my first, one of my OG team members, one of my, one of my babies, man, it's one of my babies. It's just really cool, I love its design, I love just like the spiky, like, like just, it really does kind of embody, um, I guess the way we see electricity, like powerful, kind of untamed, kind of like, just, just crazy, man. Just crazy. And Zapdos is pretty damn crazy. Um, so yeah, I really love Zapdos. Um, in all honesty, it may be one of my... It may still be one of my favorite legendaries just in general. Um, there's a lot of cool legendaries out there. But... And it's weird for me to say that I really like Zapdos over ones that have more meaning. Maybe like than the... Um, like the Forces of Nature trio. Like I really don't like those guys. Ugh. Can't deal with those guys, but um, yeah, like there's, it, there's a lot of legendaries out there that have really cool meanings to them, but I still love Zapdos. I don't know, it's just cool, man. It's just really cool. Can I get the color that I need? Can I get the color that I need? Thank you. Jeez. Okay. Oh, that's not the right layer then. Okay, hang on. Okay, because I'm at like, I'm at the four, four minutes and thirty seconds mark, so. I may want- I may try to only give myself like 30 seconds after the 5 minute mark to be honest. Uh, cause again I do wanna- I, I, this is a more complicated Pokemon that I've never drawn before so I kinda do wanna give myself a little bit of slack and just be like, hey, it's gonna, sorry it's gonna happen. In fact the only Pokemon that I've actually been able to draw within the time period has been Dino. So I'm sorry about that but oh well. Um, but I do- I do want to try, you know, I do want to try my best. Ugh, I'm already past five minutes, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Um, okay, and then it's little, whoops. There we go, it's little leg things here, which are actually the same color as the background. Wow, it's pretty much the same color as the background, cool. Um, and then I'm gonna go do its eye things. Mm. Mm. Okay. maybe like one of the I think besides the Zora like this is the only one that actually has eyes no actually I think the um I think the Scolopede ended up with eyes too but uh yeah okay sorry I am concentrating on these eyes I don't know even though they look horrible but it's okay I already told you guys not to really expect much from like, these five minute doodles but end okay so that is that was that was a six minute drawing but that's okay um, whoops, get on screen, oh, uh, zoom out, there we go, whoops, okay, there we go, that's much better, that was much better, um, Zapdos is my favorite electric type, I already told you kind of why, it's pretty cool, it's my baby, it was really strong and really helped me through a lot of stuff in Pokemon Yellow and everything, it's really cool. So thank you guys for joining me for this episode of, or for, yeah, for day four of the 31 day challenge, um, if you are joining me and you haven't, like, and you don't know what this is? Go ahead and check out the introduction video. Um, it's all on the it's all on the same playlist. So 
you can go watch the previous ones, you can go watch the introduction one. Um, honestly, a lot of us are having a lot of fun with this, so if you want to join us, that is fantastic. I really, like, you don't have to do videos. You can do videos, you don't have to. You can do drawings, but you don't have to. You can just, you know, tell me in the comment section. But if you do do drawings, I want to see them, tweet them at me, or link them to me in the in the comment section. If you're doing videos, tweet your link at me, or tweet, or, or in the comment section again, like, post it somewhere so I can see, because I want to know. Thank you for joining me for the 31 day challenge, day four. Um, I hope to see you back tomorrow. Tomorrow is fairy type, if I'm not mistaken. I think we finally reached the letter F. So. Yeah, join me back tomorrow to find out what my favorite fairy type is and so that you can tell me yours. And yeah, I'll see you.